So, if your TRX-420 happens to have a problem with the fuel injection system, and it probably will, or the electronic shifting system, it will flash the check engine light, and then you can use that to figure out, or at least help you figure out what the problem is. So in order to read that, you're going to turn the key on. Should you have a trouble code, it'll start to flash here on the dash. So it'll do long blinks and short blinks. So the long blinks are about 1.3 seconds and the short blinks are about a half a second. So if we watch this here, I'll let it cycle around again. Okay, so it's going to go 1, 2, 1, 2, 3. So that's two long blinks and three short blinks. So the long blinks equal 10. So two of those is 20. And then the three short blinks are just one. So that'd be 10, 20, and then one, two, three. So it's a 23. And then in our manual, we'll put the, the chart for these trouble codes so you'll be able to identify. And that happens to be an O2 sensor. And we didn't make this happen. This machine's been parked here in the shop probably for about a year. It rarely gets ridden. And now we're going to do our manual and we go to get it out. It's probably what some people experience. And now all of a sudden it's flashing a trouble code and it's just been sitting in the shop here. So who knows what that is, but we'll get all the body work off as we start our repair mail production. That way we can kind of visualize it better and see all the sensors. And we'll go down to this O2 sensor here and see what, why is it um, flashing a code?